Okay, here we go. 21st of October, 1 p.m. when I'm doing this video. Location is Zuri. Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back to my YouTube channel. It's Alex here. I am so excited about uh, this that I'm doing right now. I don't know if you have seen on my Instagram and also in my shorts of my YouTube channel, but I have announced that from today, 21st of October, up until Sunday, the 27th of October, I will be posting daily videos on my YouTube channel at 6 p.m. Malta time. Please mark alarms, mark the calendar, mark the days. Alex in Malta is going around the entire island and making YouTube videos for you guys to enjoy. I'm starting with the first location, which is Zuri. Simple reason, because I live in Zuri and I wanted to make uh, this for you. Starting from the place where I live, starting from the south part of Malta, going to the central part of Malta and then ending in the north part of Malta. If you guys are excited for this video, please make sure to like the video, share it with anyone that loves Malta and would like to see videos of this beautiful island. And don't forget to subscribe to my YouTube channel. Now, I'm filming these videos in 4K with 120 frames, meaning that you're going to get the best quality when it comes to uh, video and also audio as well, hopefully. <laughs> I'm filming these videos with uh, iPhone 16 Pro Max with the best uh, quality so that uh, you guys can enjoy and see how Malta looks like at uh, this time of the year. Also, I need you down in the comments of this video to let me know which city you would like me to go next because the agenda is for me to go and film during the day and then edit the video and post it in the evening at 6 p.m. So basically everything that you're going to see is going to be kind of like live. Ooh, losing my breath. <laughs> and I just started. It's two minutes of the video. So... As I mentioned, we are in Zuri, the place where I live, and I want to take you around and show you how beautiful this town is or a village for a Maltese standard. I have noticed that uh, there is the bus over there, so the kids will come out from the primary school, which is on this side, as you can see. Also, surprisingly, there are still some trees here on the island, <laughs> as you can see. Beautiful. I will be focusing more into showing you how the cities look like rather than uh, my face. So my face will come out on the uh, screen just a few times throughout the video, not all the time. I want you to see the beauty of Malta, how everything looks at the moment. So yeah, let's explore Zuri. Also, these videos I'm pretty sure are going to be helpful for anyone that is planning to come over to Malta. And you might be thinking of moving to a place like this. My God, I'm going to the square and I can see a bit of the square and the church now. <gasps> also, very, very important, guys. I want you to watch the videos in full. So please watch them from the beginning until the very end, because it, these videos are going to be packed with quite a lot of information, especially for the villages and the cities where I'm walking. So, I'm approaching the square in Zuri. Let me just stand here. Okay, so there is a bus stop over there. There was a bus number 1117. You can check online on the public transport of Malta, which buses are connecting uh, from certain areas towards Zuri. The first one that I'm going to tell you, it's from the uh, from Valletta, which is bus number 81 or 71. <laughs> I'm going to have to check. Wait, I want to walk in the middle. One second, because I want you to see a nice view of the church. Also from both sides, we are going to see what uh, Zuri has to offer. There is a pharmacy. I don't know why is it closed. Ah, maybe it's a siesta time, so they closed it for now. Zuri is very quiet, as you can see, very, very quiet. In front of me, we have uh, the 
parish church of St. Catherine. There are two feasts here in Zuri every year. We have the first feast that is happening in July and it's the last week of uh, July and it's the one of uh, Our Lady of Mount Carmel. This is a beautiful a ceremony that you're going to see on the screen. I will just try to publish a bit of this year, what I have recorded. It was such an amazing feeling. Also in the description of this video, you are going to see uh, the link from where you can find uh, the whole video that I have done of um, this feast. There is the police station on our left side. The main door. We're gonna give a 20 to 30 seconds appreciation of the beauty of this church just in this way also another important thing i will be rating the cleanliness of all the villages that i'm going to show you so far zuri it's pretty pretty clean all these traditional villages in uh, malta are always super super clean we have a pasticeria and there should be another one yes <laughs> No, it's not. It's a Turkish pizza grill, Kayan. Oh, wow, I never paid attention. I thought it's two pasticerias. It's okay. Here we are on the side. Wait a minute. I think I forgot to tell you the second uh, feast that is happening in uh, Zuri. Oh, my God, Alex. So the second uh, feast that is happening in Zuri, it's actually in September. And uh, it's uh, the... Uh, one of uh, Santa Caterina herself. And that's the biggest one in Zuri. So it's bigger than uh, the Lady of Mount Carmel. Wait, let me try to cross. I love this part. The colors of the buildings. Beautiful. Okay, we are halfway through the video. I'm doing these videos all filmed in one go without any edits, without any jump cuts or anything like that, unless there is music. So that's the only time when I'm going to have to uh, cut a video or put any music on top of it. I just want you to feel the whole vibe of the cities. Home decor needs. Okay. Uh oh, my shoelace. Hold on. <laughs> <laughs> Kitty! 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 Hey! Oh. Imagine she bites me. Ranili! How cute you are! Oh, choo -choo 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 -choo. <laughs> you want to be in my video? You want to come with me? Okay, let's go. Let's go. <laughs> oh, Kitty. Bye. <laughs> oh, someone else is calling her as well. Hello. Okay, uh, we are passing to next to another pasticeria as well. Hmm, should I grab a pasticeria or no? No, later. We have a barber on this side, which is closed. My God, I think I caught the worst time. <laughs> a siesta time. So everything is closed. But it's okay. Still, you can see that... Uh, the village, it's uh, quite empty. I mean, it's Monday, it's 1 p.m., so people are at work. <gasps> oh, wait, hold on. Let me take a video of this part. Nice. Brand Green Funeral Services. HSBC Bank is here, oh, which reminds me that I need to go to the bank. There is also BOV, but it's on the other side. This is HSBC. Hello. Kifinti. Taiva. How sweet. <laughs> she was with a smile. Maltese people, so warm, especially in this part of Malta. I love it. I'm so happy to live in a place like this. 
after living in the area of Sliem and Gzira for five years. Now I've been, uh, no, more than five years, sorry. Wait a minute. I've been in Zuri two and a half years and I've been nearly 10 years in Malta. Yeah. Okay. 10 minutes of the video, another five minutes. We are going now inside the tiny streets of Zuri. The post office is here. Wait, let me show you the opening hours of the post office. And also you're going to see me. Hey. <laughs> Monday to Saturday from 7.30 in the morning until 1 p.m. No smoking, no pets, no headwear. What? <laughs> All right. Ah, I wish this was live stream, completely live, so I can ask you whether you would like me to go left side or right side. What do you think, guys? Shall I continue on the left or shall I continue on the right? Let's just give a quick peek. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. Hmm. Mm -hmm. hmm. I think I should be going on this way. Also, I think that doing this type of video, so a 15 minutes uh, walking straight down without any cuts is giving you a nice vibe like you guys are with me. And I think that there will be some people who are living abroad and maybe they were born in Zuri and now they're going to see how it looks like and maybe it will bring you some memories from back in your childhood or anything like that. I'm so happy. That's why I love doing this type of videos. And for me, it's very easy. Doing this 15 minutes, just walking around, perfect. Wait, let me zoom. Nice. Car is coming and it's a tight street. Ah! <laughs> I don't know where I'm going to end up if I'm walking from uh, this side. <gasps> wow. Taylor. Very nice. Oops, music, 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 music. Let me speak, let me speak. So I interrupt the music so it doesn't go in the video. So I don't get a copyright. Oh my God, wait. Wow. This is beautiful. Absolutely amazing. I think this looks like fresh paint. Maybe somebody bought this and refurbished it. Stunning. Okay, 13 minutes, last two minutes of the video. Let's see how we're gonna end up on this side. Very important, it's not mandatory, but anyone who would like to uh, support my work and anything that I'm doing uh, on my YouTube channel, down in the description of this video, uh, you have uh, my PayPal and also my Revolut for the little donations. You know, every little counts and every little helps. So whoever is uh, here to support the channel, thank you so much. As I said, it's not mandatory. Let's see where I'm gonna end up. It's been a while since the last time I walked on this side. <laughs> I know. One more important thing I wanted to tell you guys, just in case the video is longer than 15 minutes, there was a reason behind it. And maybe it's because I'm going to take you to uh, another part, which is very important for you to see. And I think maybe it's a good idea if I just pass from this side and I turn on the left and I come out on the main road, which is the Blue Grotto Avenue. By the way, we have a dentist as well. These are the details. You can take screenshots just in case you are coming over to Zuri. You want to live here or you just want to visit. There it is, another house on sale. By the way, very important thing that I want you guys to know about this type of buildings is that they are in an you see a area, meaning that you cannot build anything on top of them. You can build something like what you see here, not on the main edge, but behind. 
I don't know if this makes sense. Okay, last one minute of the video. Please do let me know what do you think about Zuri. I would like you guys to rate it in the comment section as well. I want to hear your opinion. Does uh, Zuri give you a nice vibe? Do you like it? Would you consider living in such a peaceful area like Zuri? Or you're more into uh, the uh, city vibe like uh, Sliema or St. Julian's? Okay, I think I can end the video over here now. <laughs> Thank you so much for watching, guys. I hope you enjoyed it. Uh, if you do, make sure to like this video, subscribe to my YouTube channel if you haven't already, and just share it to anyone that might be moving to Malta or just is a lover of Malta. Till I see you in my next one, tomorrow, 22nd of October, at 6 p.m. Malta time. Bye!